Hi, I'm Hub Arkish for Pro Football Weekly as we bring you more of our exclusive NFL Way We Hear It, all the news, scoops, and rumors before they happen. Interesting story out of Seattle. Everybody's pretty happy right now. Nobody saw the route of the 49ers coming on opening day. This was supposed to be a down year, a rebuilding year, the new regime of Pete Carroll. But that big win seems to have swept one story under the rug, and that is the sudden retirement of offensive line coach, and I should say legendary offensive line coach Alex Gibbs just a week before the season. He was brought in to be the guru, particularly with their first round draft pick Russell Okong at left tackle, and yet all he said upon his retirement is, I'm exhausted, I'm gassed, I can't do it anymore. Well, he's only 69 years old, I say only, that's long, long in the tooth in coaching circles, but nonetheless a lot of guys coach beyond it, and we're hearing there was more to the story than Alex Gibbs just being a little bit tired. Apparently there were roster decisions made on that offensive line when final cutdown time came that Gibbs was not all that happy about, didn't get the personnel he wanted to work with, and there is a definite feeling out process going on in Seattle right now between Pete Carroll and his staff of assistants. All we know now is he is done in Seattle. Now, Pete Carroll thinks he's okay with what he's got left on the offensive line, both coaches and players may be. But don't let the excitement of opening day fool you. This is a team in transition, and it's going to be very interesting to see those who are left around Pete Carroll, how this regime rebuilds this football team. That's going to do it on the Seahawks, but we've got lots more NFL Way We Hurt for you all the time right here at ProFootballWeekly.com.